Hello, this is Tom from Stafford Audi, and today I will be taking you around this brand new vehicle which we have in stock here. This is our Audi Q5 Black Edition 40 TDI with the Quattro and S-Tronic transmission and gearbox. As this is the 40 TDI model, you can expect to see up to 137 miles per hour top speed, a 0 to 62 of 7.6 seconds, and a consumption of 39.8 to 42.2 miles per gallon combined. This particular vehicle is finished in the wonderful Navara blue metallic paintwork and as it is a black edition it has the black roof rails, mirror caps, gloss black side skirts and really looks super sporty and really stylish. Coming around onto the rear we can see those rear LED lights with rear dynamic indicators which gives perfect visibility from the rear of the vehicle. Having a closer look at that black mirror cap with integrated indicator and now we see the 20 inch Audi Sport 5 V spoke star design alloy wheels finished in the anthracite black with a diamond cut gloss finish. Taking a close look at that black front grille with the Quattro badge there and here we see those matrix LED headlights which do include a dynamic indicator which just add to the overall sporty look of the vehicle whilst offering maximum visibility. This vehicle also has front and rear parking sensors as well as a rear camera for those tight spots in any car parking situation. As mentioned before, this is the black edition so it comes with black wing mirrors, black roof rails. It also comes with dark and rear glass to give those rear occupants a little bit of privacy from drivers at the side of you. And also comes with those gloss black side skirts which really add to the look of the vehicle and look brilliant against that metallic paintwork. A double press of the boot button on the key shows off those rear dynamic indicators, opens the electrically operated tailgate and shows off the 520 litres of boot space. If you fold the rear seats down you get 1520 litres of boot space, perfect for that push chair or the weekend away luggage and you just press the button on the tailgate itself to close it back down again for you. Onto the inside of the vehicle, it's finished in partial leather, partial Alcantara seats. The front seats are sport seats and the rear seats do have a slightly more sporty look to them. There is the third zone of climate control for those rear passengers to be at a different temperature and the two outer seats have isofix points to securely and safely travel with up to two child seats and also a centre armrest for that extra added comfort. Onto the front we can see the leather flat bottom S-line multifunction steering wheel dual zone climate control and heated seat function for the front as well as that touchscreen display. As mentioned here are those front sport seats with S-line badge embossing at the top, also in leather and Alcantara, manually adjustable with the four way lumbar support and a take a look at those Bang & Olufsen speakers which are on all four doors just to make that sound system extra clear for those tunes on the radio. Looking now at what the driver sees, we get a better look at that leather wrapped multifunction steering wheel. On the left is your controls for your virtual cockpit. You press the view button, you can make your dials bigger and smaller. You've got nav, you've got all your driving consumption figures and short term and long term memory. And also you can change your radio station using the toggle switch on the left. On the right is your voice controls and audio controls, so those mid-journey phone calls. And underneath to the left is your digital speed limiter and cruise control, making those motorway journeys all the better. Now onto the central touchscreen display where you can have your Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, DAB and FM radio stations, or simply just the navigation and Bluetooth of your phone. Under the climate control we have the Audi Drive Select giving you maximum control over the overall feel of the vehicle as well as bringing up that rear camera and front and rear sensors or also this vehicle comes with the Park Assist Plus making parking all the easier. Both front seats do come with the heated functionality as well as touch sensitive toggles for all aspects of the air conditioning. We have the stop start button as well as a little cubby hole and the perforated leather gear selector. Just press the button on the side, slide it forwards and backwards. Electronic handbrake and finally the centre armrest with the wireless charger which slides backwards and forwards to hide or reveal those 
cup holders 